Greetings, everybody. Guzzle here, checking out another game for you guys today. This is XO. It is a space, crazy space uh, RTS strategy type game. Your goal in this game is to build an, a ragtag armada and fight your way out of the galaxy. I've done the tutorial, so let's jump right into a new game. And here's our starting kind of setup here. Here is our captain. We have a starting fleet. I can't change that to anything at the mo- Oh, yeah, I, yeah, nothing's unlocked. So uh, you can unlock different kind of uh, setups here. You get a different ship, and you get different relations with the different um, factions. And that's one of the things in this game you have to manage. So starting off, we have basically negative full negative relations with all the different factions so we're not going to get a lot of help as we go along until we can um kind of start to build our armada we're going to do beginner because guys this game is very deep if this is the type of stuff that if you love space combat space exploration armada kind of management game there is a lot of game here for you guys if that's your thing but anyway i digress Here's the beginning of our adventure. The packed fleet has been destroyed by the harvesters, an unknown, unstoppable force. Yours is the last battleship remaining. Your orders. Gather ships and lead survivors to the next jump gate. You will be able to save everyone. Choose wisely. I should also mention, guys, this game is still in early access, so that should be uh, highlighted, but uh, we're going to press on. Here we go. Here is our ship, the Alexander. Let us hail this station here, and we'll see what we got going on here. So I think the graphic style is really cool. It's this kind of like, you know, battle grid um, hologram type look, which I think is pretty cool. All right, so the harvesters have entered the sector, and war has broken out. Via the drone nets, you see the following urgent calls for assistance. None are required, but only one can be accepted. Our first option is we could settle a squabble between corp and rover ships, possible ship coordinates, other rewards. We could use a boarding party to assault a harvester warship. We get some marines and a possible ship. Attach a pack scout to your fleet and use it to help find other ships. Reveal your general orders returning to these choices afterwards okay what are our general orders we've lost the war our only option appears to be running adding ships to your fleet will increase your chances of survival hailing ships is one way to do that who you save is up to you keep jumping good luck your humanity's last hope be mindful of your actions everything you do as a consequence for good or ill always remember that the factions are fickle their opinion of you will change rapidly based on how you treat them. You have many opportunities to influence them. All right. Our faction is the Pact, by the way, guys, if that wasn't clear. I think of these choices here, the, the first two sound like they might be fairly risky. And I don't even think we have a boarding party, to be honest. I don't think we actually have that on our ship. I'm going to take this option. It says attach a pack scout to your fleet. Okay, where's our scout? Let's take a look. Is that him coming in? All right, that's our scout, I think. Let's hail him. I think that's our scout. <laughs> I hope so. Okay. The farsighted has joined our fleet and is standing by for the orders. Explain the scout ship's muster ability and how to use it. Okay. Using the muster command, you can order a scout ship to jump ahead of the fleet and look for passengers of a certain faction or ships that can help you with a specific resource. Okay. Scouting is risky. There's no guarantee that your scout ship will be there when you arrive, that they will be successful in their mission, or that the people or ships they find will be receptive to joining with you. However, you can improve the chances of success by sending the scout ship further ahead of the fleet. Okay. We're, we got the scout added into the uh, fleet. So you guys can see on the left here, here is our fleet, our armada. Now we got another ship there. 
And now, check it out. He's flying in formation with our mothership here, which is kind of nice, huh? Tell you what, though. Let's... Let's say... Um, we'll scan him. Let's make him jump ahead. Okay, so... Now that we've kind of got this set up, we've got our kind of our starting bonus. Let's go ahead and enter the uh, star map here. And now this is where the... Um, this is where the uh, the scout is going to come in handy, I think. So we've got all these different jump gates we can get to. Let's see. Uh, we want to. Let's see what's what's in this one. Let's take a look here. Nav scout. All right, so we can send the scout by dragging him there. Boom, he's out. It says fifteen. I don't know if that. What does fifteen mean? I wonder. Let's close this. Um, he's gonna scout. There he goes. I think while he's doing that, maybe we ought to go over here. Let's let's go ahead and jump there while the scout's doing his thing. Oh, wait a second. He's already coming back. That was really quick. The scout has returned. What did he find out? Oh, he found out that there is a fixer and a tramp freighter there. Their ore is not found. Slow water collection. Rapid fuel collection. Okay, so every time you jump to a new uh, planet or sector, you do have to worry about fuel and water. So what if we send the scout here? Since it's a lot faster than I thought, um, let's send the scout and we'll see what's in, in that area there. Uh, does he have to... There could be a cooldown to the... To the scout, perhaps. It's day four. Why isn't he scouting, I wonder? Let's take a look. Another... I don't know what happened there. Scouting 15. I think he's going now. Okay, there he goes. I think if we play this, like, carefully, we have a better chance of, of getting some good stuff. Okay, he's back. What did he find out? We have a corp merchant there. We can get water, we can get fuel, and we can get ore. Rapid ore collection possible. Ice available for melting. Okay. Let's send him here. Okay, scouting 15. Send him. Let's review all of our options. You know, before we go. I think he I think there's there's a like a slight cooldown on the uh scout it looks like. I think that's what's going on. The nice thing is our scout um, is saving us a ton of fuel and water because we're not having to make the jump manually. So we could actually do have an informed decision here as to what is what, which is, whoa, what do we got here? We got carrier, the impactor. We have a packed battleship. Um, Interesting. This looks kind of crazy. Oh, Harvester's the enemy, right? We don't really want to... We're definitely not set up to take on a huge armada like this. So let's not go there quite yet. Let's review. This seemed to be fine because it has one merchant ship. Which, we, we don't really have any money, though, to spend on uh, items. But this has a fixer and a tramp freighter. I suppose... Uh, we're not going to really get... We're going to lose water if we go there. Interesting. Maybe that's our best bet, huh? Is to go here. Yeah, let's go here. Alright, we're going to... We're going to jump, dude. Jump is ready. Here we go. Hit it. All right, there's the other ship. Where's our scout at? Let's look at our formation. I forgot to do that before. Let's put the scout 
kind of close by. There's our, uh, by the way, there's our, um, our mother ship there. What is this ship? Okay. Uh, we'll just keep the, keep the, um, wait a second. Can this, I don't think this ship can mine anything. Not yet. Yeah. Okay. For now, that's fine. Okay. There is a ship over here. This ship right there is, it says discounted stock. All right. Let's hail this thing. Corp crew, he's got a laser on him. He might attack us. But let's hail him. Um, just to say, you know, if he's a merchant, maybe we can buy something. I don't know. He may also just a straight up attack us. So we'll see, guys. I think he is attacking. It certainly looks to be the case. What is he about to do here? Oh, he's attacking. Okay. <laughs> they did not waste any time. So we attack. I think we attack, dude. Can I use the... Can I use this guy to... Does he have any... Um... Can you attack too? Let's see. Let's see, guys. Here we go. Here goes the battle. I don't think the scout can attack. Um. Hey, what... Can you... Uh... Attack this guy. There we go. Dude, you made a big mistake. I'm a warship. You know what you're even doing? You're going to get blasted. Oh. What is that flying off? Okay, I think we got him. Offering a bounty for evacuation. Let's hail him. Or let's evacuate him. Let's try to evacuate this crew off of there. And maybe we get some cashola. Mercenaries. We we'll bring them on board, dude. We can't take their weapon, unfortunately, but we got the mercenaries. All right, the evacuation. Your loyal mercenaries come quickly aboard the Alexander, adding to overall security of the ship. And look at that. Our relations with the faction corp have improved. So now we uh, we have improved our relations a little bit. We're neutral now. All right. So that was worthwhile. We did have to, you know, destroy their ship. I wonder, is there something else we can do with that ship? Maroon destroy support. Okay, well, never mind. All right. Well, we got a uh, fuel recharged, it looks like. Water, I don't know. Uh, yeah, so th that's just a dead ship, pretty much. So that's kind of all that's here, it looks like. So let's jump out to the next area. And we send our scout. I don't know what this purple area is, but it looks pretty dangerous. Let's send our scout here. And off you go, dude. So is he scouting? It says he's scouting, right? There he goes. All right. Let's see what's over here. He's coming back. What you got for us? We have an enemy ship, the Peace Liner. We have fuel available, but water loss will occur. How about over here? This is Harvester region. Okay, that's what it, that's what's up. I worry that if we send the scout into the Harvester region, he's going to get destroyed. I really don't want that to happen. The scout's been incredibly useful so far. So let's jump here. And uh, hope this ship doesn't wreck us too bad. But we're going to find out, huh? All right, the other ship is over here. Tor. Hailing frequencies open. Let's hail him. 
We'll see what he's got to say. Hopefully it's not an ambush. I hear battle music. The pacifists. It is difficult for me to ask because we abhor violence, but we have no other choice. We have no shields and become separated from our kind. We beg your aid and protection. What is... Oh, that's your faction. Okay. Let's go ahead and do it. Okay, so we have... Irenic. The elite Irenic. Dedicated to nonviolence. They spend most of their time debating the health benefits of complex and overprepared snacks. We should go ahead and agree to take them to safety. And so we will take you with us. All right, gained eight ore. And then Tor has joined the fleet. Relations with the Irenic have slightly improved. Hell yeah. Awesome, man. All right, let's look at our... Uh, let's modify our... Actually, what is their ship like? Uh, they have water on the cargo. But they have no weapons. So we have to protect them. Let's look at our... Uh, Sorry, let's, um, I want to change our, um, formation here. There we go. Okay. Uh, I was right-clicking on it. This didn't seem to be working. Let's throw them right behind our ship. It's a slow ship. What does that mean? What is slow ship? We'll put him behind the, um, our main ship so that hopefully they stay protected. All right, that's a good find here. Is that all that's here? I think so, huh? Oh, we gained two water, it looks like. So that's fantastic. Um, let's go back out. Now we say... Um, what's, what's with the gears, I wonder? It says trading beacon detected. Okay. Is this where we came from? No. All right, send the scout out there. And we'll let him do his thing. So I've got I'm actually like a little confused where we came from. I don't know what's going on out here, dude. This looks kind of interesting. The scout is back. He found, oh boy. A supply ship executioner enforcer. Okay, that's that's uh, uh, quite a few enemies there. And we still don't have... I still feel like we don't have enough firepower, really, to deal. Um, I got a little turned around. I'm going to be honest, guys. I can't, I can't remember which way we came from. Um, but anyway, let's scout this. Scouting 15. Mm, cooldown? I think we didn't, we didn't wait long enough. For the cooldown. Send him again. There he goes. But yeah, the scout seems to be really good. Saving us a lot of fuel. What do we got over here? Okay, Irenic Peace Liner Sanctuary. This might be where we need to take these guys. So let's go ahead and go there. It seems fairly safe. Let's jump. Okay, so we have what is this guy? This is Aquarius. Uh, we have this. This seems to be. Let's hail this guy. I feel like our our uh, um, the ship that we picked up that's slow. We need to bring them here. I think. Okay, so we got a we got Annabelle Samuel, the packed tactical officer, the contraband discovery. Sir, the tour had a minor leak, and we sent some people over to fix it. Well, they found some contraband, a ship's weapon. Uh, can I take it? I'd love another laser. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, 
Uh oh, it's this field around this crazy looking base, dude. Plasma shield. You arrive at a desperate time, warrior. We're in the final stages of evacuating. If the station is destroyed during the evacuation, we will fail. It will take us two days to complete. Will you stand with us? Uh, do you agree to defend the station for two days? Yes, we will help you defend if you join with us. If you join with us, yes, and we are willing to help evacuate your people if you need it. Um, uh, this seems to be... This seems to be the better option, don't you guys think? Our mission is to gather survivors and make for safety. We will stand with you if you and your people join with us. Additionally, we can assist with evacuating your people. We agree on all points. Evacuating our people if you can, but our top priority is defense. Okay. Um. So, what is this ship? The Buckler. We're going to have to defend this ship. Tor wants to wants to hail this ship. Well, let's let him do it. Okay. Um, so hold on a second. We got this ship here. Okay. I'm a little nervous, guys. We'll see what this battle's going to be like if they come to, you know, raid it. What is this thing? Aquarius. Let's hail this guy. We'll see what this is all about. Maybe he can help us out. We have to defend it, you know? This is the non-decision-making communication delegate of Aquarius. Our collective management has asked me to relay our request for your guarantee of safe passage if it's written within your means. We eagerly array. Okay. Another uh, escort. Sure. We'll protect you. We are engaging our emergency discussion group to evaluate our options. Okay. We got more ore. Sweet. Oh shit, we're out of water though. Look at this, guys. Uh we need to we need to handle that. Okay, the water situation. Supply chief here. We have an urgent water situation. First I've adjusted your display to include a readout of our current water. Look for the water droplet next to our fuel gauge. Yeah. You can see a minus one. It means we don't have enough water for all the people in the fleet. Very soon riots will start. Okay. We need to get water. Okay. Yeah, well, it seems like we're already out. How do we add additional water capacity? Food ships. The Empire and Rover have stasis technology. Um, okay, we need to get water. So I thought one of our ships has water. They have cargo in their water. Hey, look at that. I hope that doesn't make them angry, but <laughs> they just use their water up, dude. It's fine. All right, another slow ship, which is not ideal. What is this ship now? The buckler? Okay, it's fine. Everything's in formation. Okay. We're not trying to talk to them anyway. I don't know. It seems to be. Oh, well, we never hailed this ship here. Let's uh let's go ahead and do that. Oh wait, no, he's in our formation now. Oh, water riots again? I thought we just solved that. Do I have to evacuate them or are they are they okay?
Okay. Let's try, I, I'm curious. I kind of need, we kind of need to deal with this water situation, you know? Um, do I have to evacuate this ship? I'm seeing this timer up here and it's making me a little bit a little bit uh, I can't do it or can I to tour I hope that was the right thing to do I'm not totally sure I don't know why this is X'd out. We got more ore, dude. And we got a ship. Sweet. But how about some water, man? Can you hook me up, dude? Let's take a look one more time. Um, Sorry, I got to select the ship first. Then we go... Launch mercenaries. They got nothing on them, dude, except for some ore. I think we're fine. We can't really get any water from them. Let's go back out to the star map. We got to get this water situation under control. We get the scout going. Where did he go? Yeah, there he is. Please tell me there's some water out there. I think if there's a, uh, if there's a, a merchant, maybe we can buy water. We got to have this handled, though, huh? So wait a minute. Now the water's fine. I don't get it. Okay. What did you find out? Oh, there's a bunch of water here. We do have some enemy ships, though, perhaps. Is Empire enemies? I don't. I think at this point, we don't have much of a choice. Yeah, we have to go here. Yeah. This could be a kind of a disaster, but we need water badly enough. All right, there's a ton of enemies over here. Oh, they're probably attacking the ship, huh? Hailing frequencies open. Yikes, dude, this looks pretty bad. We got a Larkspur missile launcher. What's this thing? We, this is our a mining facility. Hail to trade. We got a feed bank and trust. Hailing frequencies open. I don't know, man. I kind of feel like we got to deal with this uh, water crisis like ASAP. Uh-oh. Are we getting attacked already? Uh, although the Ir Irenic are inherently peaceful, that doesn't mean that they're well-liked. So I better watch what I do with any Irenic defense ships under my control like the Buckler. She's certain to be attacked if I order her to engage with a faction that is an enemy with Irenic. If only there was a way to exploit that. Okay. Um, I like that this guy's got a shield, though. That's pretty good. What's What the hell's taking so long? Go over there. There we go. I don't know why... Oh, maybe it was X'd out because I was under the, uh, the shield? I don't know. Do you guys have any water? Give me some damn water. Cargo fuel. Okay, we need, uh... The snacks get us... It can be used to immediately add plus one water to the fleet. Ooh, this improves our uh, the scout. Oh, man, I really... 
Fuel. It's great you have fuel, but you got no damn water, dude. We got two weapons already. Uh, man, that's so expensive, too. Ten? Yeah. Let's throw on the, uh, the enhanced sensors on this ship. So that's nice. And then we say... Even though it really sucks, we gotta buy water. Just kidding, we can't afford it. <laughs> okay, you know what? Let's look at our... All the ships in our fleet, there's more water right there. I don't want to trade it, I want to use it. Let's get out of the, uh... Let's get out of trading. Uh, you have water. Use it. Okay. I hope that helps. This other ship over here, perhaps... Maybe they got water. Let's find out. Let's hail them. And we're do we don't seem to be under attack yet, which is really nice. We're still we're losing water like crazy, though. What good for what good fortune to encounter you? We're just heading to run here only. Well, you see, we have reason to believe there may be empire ships out there. We're really trying to avoid an encounter. Could you possibly come along with us there? Sure. Deal, dude. Oh my god, we got water. Factory food ship. Huge. So huge. I don't know, man. I feel like if we if we hail these guys, we're like we might be pressing our luck here. This looks pretty gnarly, huh? But let's we have to do it, I guess. It's corp crew. Hmm. Let's just hail them and see what's up. This could be a mistake, I don't know. What's this? Oh, that's the ship we got. So let's here we go. Don't attack me, please. We're currently under contract for the Empire, but if you can make us a better offer, we'll gladly provide fuel to you. I don't need fuel, man. So I'm going to say no. Offer the tanker one ore to join. Uh, I don't think they're going to do it for one ore, man. And we'd probably sour relations with Corp. I'm going to say I'm not interested. Sorry, buddy. Okay. Well, we avoided getting attacked, so that I'm okay with that. Okay, sorry. We're I think we're running out of time to go to the... To, it's a run here. Where's... Oh, there we go. It's right here. Let's just go ahead and jump straight there. Because I don't think we have time to wait. We gotta go now. We're almost running out of time. We're gonna make it, I think. Let's take him there. Okay. How you guys... What we got here? Oh, uh, Apollo. All the ships are here. An Empire Executioner closing in on the food ship that attacks speed. They're broadcasting a message. The Avoider. We will have our vengeance. Stand in our way if you dare. We've gained three water, which is awesome. Relations with the Empire have slightly worsened. While you successfully brought the food ship feed bank and trust here, those Empire ships sure don't look happy about it. They're attacking. Okay, stop. What is attacking now? High-grade gear. Is it this guy? 
Okay, so let's let's review our armada. Um, where's this dude? We gotta we gotta protect him. So I'll, tell, I'll put him there because here's the shield. Uh, let's take the scout out of there. Everybody's in the shield pretty much. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Um, I forget. Yeah, I forget how to make them all go back into formation. But let's find out who's attacking. Um, what's support? Turn around, come back. I don't know where the attack's coming from. Everybody get in the damn shield, though. Oh, here we go. Okay. Okay, he's got missile launchers. And then, and then so basically I think we just got shot by missiles. So that kind of sucks. <laughs> but now we're back in the shield. Why are you not attacking, dude? Fire. I don't know what is happening. Attack this guy. Yeah, okay, I don't want you to um I want you to leave. She attack this dude. Okay, get out of the There we go. Okay, let's What is he launching? Those must be missiles, right? Okay. I think the scout oh shit, he got hit hard, huh? Yikes. Okay, this is bad. I thought he was protected by the shield. Oh, shit, is he dead? Okay, we got to deal with this pronto. Now attack this damn thing. Farsighted is disabled. I don't know what we can do about that. Abandon. Oh, no. Is there a crew on that ship? Oh, shit, there is. Holy crap. <sighs> Damn it. All right, that kind of sucks. I think we got to try to evacuate them. Come on, man, get over there. Let's take uh, our crew off of there. We lost our scout ship, which really sucks, man, because that was really useful. But what can we... Oh, shit, he gets right through the shields. What? All right, I guess I overestimated the shields, huh? Holy crap, dude. I think we are, uh, we're in trouble here. Dang, like a huge chunk got blown off. Holy crap, I can't believe it, dude. We're out of space. Damn, we're getting rocked. On, dude. Guess we needed better weapons, huh? What if there's anything we do with the disabled ships? As soon as we kill this damn thing. Shoot him. Oh, we're just getting destroyed, huh? Dang. Holy crap. Taking so much damage. Wonder if we can fix the destroyed ships. The stress beacon active. Launches a mercenary boarding party. Okay, let's do it. 
I probably should have done that way before, huh? Boarding result. The defenders of the Langar completely wipe out your boarding party. <laughs> Holy crap. Wow. Well, let's, um... Guess we could try to evacuate him. We don't have any, um... We don't have any space left. So... Yeah, you know what? It's just not even important to us right now. I think the... I, yeah, I think the other ships that got disabled are dead. I think there's nothing we can do. Um, That was a terrible battle. Man, what the hell? Lost our scout. Lost one of the ships we were escorting. That was pretty bad. I thought the shield was doing a lot more for us. And uh, it obviously wasn't. <laughs> Let's see the deal with this guy. I don't know, man. That did not go well. But uh, I guess that's, you know, the risk you take, right? At least our water's back under control. This is Galacticon supply ship Apollo. It just so happens we are carrying plans for packed warships. We are prepared to grant you a perpetual use license for a set of plans in exchange for protection. How about it? Oh, what does a plan do for us? Uh, I mean, I, I'm, I'm tempted to... Tempted not to do it because we got wrecked so bad. Before, Ion Torpedo. Okay. Oh, some more, dude. Let's look at our... Uh... Damn, man, the ship's got so destroyed, huh? Uh-oh. What the hell's this? Minotaur and Ogre. That looks really bad. Okay, I don't think I'm I, I don't think I'm geared up for yet another battle. I think we got to jump, dude. We got to get out of here. Oh shit, how do we end up in freaking no wonder, dude? Oh no, what is all the Irenic sector? Corpse sector. Oh crap, we got to get out of here. Well, we lost our scout ship, which really sucks, but um let let's just go. We just got to go, guys. Hail Gigia Station to unlock the jump gate. Is that it over there? I think so, dude. Hail it. All of our ships made it. We reached the packed jump gate. The station will have to unlock the jump gate in order for us to jump to the next sector. I'm working on it. Hopefully we don't get attacked here. But man, we're in bad shape, huh? Jump gate unlock. Clear to proceed to the next sector. Okay. Alright, that was easy. Uh-oh. What is that? Yeah, they're ch they're full on chasing me, dude. We got worm and we got hydra, dude. They're coming in. They're coming in hot. Let's get out of here. Holy crap, they're just taking over the uh the whole sector. We're we're so screwed. Uh what if What if we go to the Irenic sector? We have all these Irenic ships. Let's see what happens here. This could be a mistake. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Look at that. They were, like, launching ships. They were launching ships to come after us. Is there nothing here? Oh, what? Irenic Sector. You've reached the second sector. Primary objective, reach the second jump gate. The Irenic faction leader has been spotted in this sector. Secondary objective, maintain friendly relations with the Irenic 
while locating and rescuing the faction leader. Okay. Man, I'd love to know also how to repair this ship because, man, we got rocked so freaking hard. Let's move this, our sh main ship, away from this shield. Because that was really problematic before. Okay. Yeah, we need a way to repair. Guys, the video's getting kind of long here. I'll do a couple. Oh, I think I see repair, dude. Repair beacon. There it is right there. As I say, guys, I don't want the videos to be too long, but this is a very deep game, and I hope the video conveys that because uh, there's a lot to do and a lot to explore. And if you, you know, like if you like games that you kind of really dig in, um, I think you guys would really enjoy this one. You've received an Irenic drone net transmission, but unfortunately it seems to become corrupted. All it is able to be decoded from the message is that it came from an Iren Irenic industry ship. Message was intended for you in, in a location. What do you do? Set a beacon for the location. Okay. Those ships don't look hostile, I don't think. Let's find out what's going on with this thing. I'd love to unload some of these extra ships just because they're not... They don't attack, you know? I need, I need attack sh help here. You know, it's really bad. We're under some pressure to leave immediately, so would you kindly wrap up your trading as quickly as you can? Holy crap. Are these ships? Huh. Oh, I don't have enough ore. Oh, man. Is that just a ship straight up? I think these are ships. Oh. Oh, boy. Repairs are really expensive. That sucks. This guy got nearly destroyed, so we better repair him, huh? Oh, yeah, repair. Ah, oh, so expensive. Oh my god. It's pretty bad. We're broke. That's it, dude. We're we're done. Uh what what is what's happening over here? Do we have to jump to the Over here, we have to jump here. Okay. All right, guys, this will be hopefully probably the last uh, item in the video here. We're, we're approaching uh, 50 minutes, so I got to kind of cut it. But yeah, this is a deep game. That's what I was trying to say earlier. We've made it. Uh, where's this industry ship? The mist. It's got to be this thing, right? Factory. Yeah, it's got to be this. Okay. The Durest Industry Ship. We've spotted a lone industry ship. Day 41. Rumors are circulating about the harvesters doing mass abductions on an incredible scale. As in, everyone we've ever known who isn't part of the fleet is likely gone. I don't know what to believe, but it certainly isn't doing morale any good. Despair is the order of the day. I have to keep finding ways to give people hope. Who am I kidding to give me hope? All right, we need to... Uh, we need some fuel now as well. This game's brutal, huh? Can I interest you in an inexpensive labor force? All of a sudden, nobody's buying, and this rover's dead weight to us. They're so desperate, they'll probably work for air, food, and, be and bed. Only four or... I'm broke, dude! Ah. Sorry, man. I can't... I don't want to fight them, but... That sucks, dude. Camelot has a distress beacon active. We don't go to Camelot. Tis a silly place. I have a feeling this is going to backfire. We're going to have to transfer crew off. 
if they're going to want an evacuation, probably. The Camelot has put out a mayday and has what appears to be a host has hostile pirates on board. Um, we're going to commandeer the ship, dude. Not. Uh, what are we doing here? I have a... Uh... Interesting. I have, um, I have too many crew on this ship. I guess we have... We do have, uh... One more slot. So what do we do with this thing? This ship here. Oh, he's going to get out. Dang it. We didn't. Uh, I wasn't quick enough. What a bummer. Guess we hail this guy just to see. And this will be the end of the video. What you got, dude? Hello there, Prospect. We have big news. We're no longer part of Galacticon. We splintered off to a new company, Galactic Mercs. For the low, low price of eight ore, you can have us for five days. Man, I ain't got no money, dude. Guess the ore, you got to... You got to really have that kind of, you know, set aside and be ready to kind of hang on to it. Kind of do everything with that currency, huh? Well, guys, like I said, I don't want the videos to be too long. So I'm going to go ahead and end it here. This is XO. I will include a link to the game in the description below. If you like kind of space opera strategy, um, deep games, I think you would really enjoy this one. I think the aesthetic's really cool. And uh, you guys should give it a look. That's it for me, guys. Thanks again for watching. If you have any recommendations for me, please leave a comment below. Otherwise, I do appreciate it. if you made it through the whole video. It really does help me out a lot. Sorry, this one was a bit longer. But hey, it's a deep game. What can you do? All right, guys. Thanks again for watching. That's it for me. And we'll see you for the next one.